Welcome to CHMS TV. I'm Faith Lavarchik and I'm Lindsay Laney. We will bring to you the latest in Highlander Country. First up is our feature teacher story on Mr. Opp and how he likes teaching tech ed. Mr. Opp, the former 7th grade geography teacher, acquired a new role as the middle school tech ed teacher. During this past summer, Mr. Opp spent numerous days working on a new curriculum that will be taught during the Tech Ed Special. With the new curriculum came new equipment such as the CNC machine and the 3D printer. So in the technology department here at Camber Heads Middle School, uh, we've got some new equipment. Our newest is the CNC machine. Still developing this into our curriculum, but showing the students what it's capable of. And we're going to get moving forward with it and a lot of other new technology here as fast as we can. Next up, we have the Chromebook carts. There are two carts for every grade hallway. The Chromebook carts are shared among the five core teachers in each grade. Mrs. Wargo, a sixth grade reading teacher, uses Chromebooks in her class to work on Google Classroom, Study Island, and IXL. She says it gives students time to work with technology. Students are giving their ability to check their grades, complete class assignments, write narratives, and many more activities may be completed with this technology. Now we present to you the school store. The school store is located in the hallway going to the high school and is open every activity period. Items you will find are pencils, pens, folders, notebooks, locker bodies, and many more. The store was made by Ms. Kinney, the 6th grade math teacher, but is ran by Austin Bender, Mackenzie Mulraney, Sydney Nyhart, and Parker Farball. Don't forget to stop by and pick up your daily necessities at a low cost. Welcome to the Patton Park. This park was the site of the last year's annual CH Field Day. Students had many choices of activities, although most took the advantage of the early pool access and raced to the gates. When our sports teams need support, you better believe the cheerleaders are there to get the crowd going. Here's Sammy Fogel doing an interview with Abby Abrams, the junior high cheerleading captain. Thank you, Lindsay and Faith. I'm here with Abby Abrams, the junior high cheerleading captain. She's going to give us her thoughts on why she likes the sport. I like cheerleading because it gives me an opportunity to support our football players this season. What would you recommend to younger kids who might want to try out cheerleading someday? I recommend to the younger kids that would like to try out next season to really work hard and make sure you're dedicated to this sport. Thank you. Thank you. This week's survey was on who is your favorite NFL football team. Not surprisingly, the overall winner is the Pittsburgh Steelers by a whopping 159 votes. Second was the Dallas Cowboys with 11 votes, and third was the Green Bay Packers with 10 votes. Go Steelers! Welcome back to Technoton. I'm Ethan King. And I'm Cole Weiland. This week we'll be telling you about 3D printer magic. To 3D print, you have to first design something on computer software, then upload it to a slicing software. 3D printing has advanced a lot over the last few years. In Japan, they're making small cement houses for people to live in. And in the medical field, they can even print human organs. Next week begins our school's Red Ribbon Week. Each day, students may dress accordingly to a given theme that you can find posted in the upstairs hallway. There will also be a number of drawings for exciting prizes from the numbers found on the bottom of your red ribbons that are handed out by your teachers. Always listen to the announcements in case your number is selected. At the end of the week, our annual Red Ribbon Carnival will be held with many exciting games and activities which will be available for your participation. Thank you for tuning in to this edition of CHMS-TV. I'm Faith Lavarchik. And I'm Lindsay Laney. I hope you enjoyed it as much as we did.